It's beer o'clock on Real Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from North Coast Brewing Company and it's a bottle of their brother Thelonious Belgian style ale. It's 9.4% ABV. There's a look at the label. Belgian style Abbey ale it says. There's the North Coast bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Lots of smoke on the opening, not surprised by that at all. The Belgium yeast is very, very kind of lively and, and it will kind of give you a nice bit of smoke on the opening. Wow, look at this for a beer pouring out. A lovely, dark, chestnutty, mahogany style beer. It's two fingers or one finger of a tan coloured head. Uh, it just looks really good, it looks really good in the glass, nice and clear. Nice levels of carbonation. The beer was kindly sent to us by beersofeurope.co.uk. Uh, they, they've been our channel sponsor now for nearly three years. Two and a half, just over two and a half years, pushing three years. Amazing, amazing stuff. Um, if you want to try this beer, check it out from Beers of Europe. They've got it in stock at the moment. Aroma. And I was just thinking off camera. When you, when you kind of produce a, a Belgium Abbey kind of ale at 9.4% ABV, you've got to get the style right. And, and, and looking at it, pouring at it, pouring it, smelling it. Yeah, that's, that, that style. It's smack on. It's, it's got that aroma of, of a dark fruit, lots of sweetness, like a candied sweetness. Let's dive in. Cheers. Mm. Oh yes. That's really good. That's really good. I'll tell you what I really like about Belgian beers. It's that initial fizz. Do you know when the beer hits your mouth and you get that big kind of hissing, fizzing, Almost like a sherbet lemon in your mouth, that kind of, or one of them old kind of sweets, the, the old disc Space Invader things. They kind of like exploded in your mouth. It's, it's that. It just kind of explodes and the beer's alive. It's like a raisiny little bit of kind of black currants in there little vinous quality going on that's for that ever so slightly roasted malt and I mean ever so slightly I don't mean full on roasted stout I mean it's just a little kind of tinkle of the of the roasted malt of the, of the dark malt to produce the colour of the beer but all of these little, some of the, some of the flavours are, are bigger than the others, like the candied sugar, the candied fruit, that's, that's quite a big flavour in the beer. The spiciness is a little less. Then you're talking about your flavours that are around the fringes of the beer. So you're talking about that, that slight, slight stoutness of the beer, that slight roasted malt. It's, it's on the fringes, it's just about there. It makes your brain think about the beer and what you're tasting. That, that vinous quality is there in the distance. It's not full on, but all of these little flavours that are poking in from all angles, trying to attack that big kind of candied fruit flavour, just add to the quality of the beer. It's very drinkable as well for a 9.4% ABV beer. It's not big, it's not thick, it's not gloopy. It's quite refreshing. Granted, if I wasn't reviewing the beer, I would be sipping it slowly. But for reviewing purposes, I'm drinking it quite quickly. I wouldn't suggest to kind of gulp back a 9.4% ABV beer like we're doing today. But 
but you can. And that's the point of it. That's why I'm saying it. You can. The quality of it, the, the drinkability of it. I might suffer later, but for now it's it's so drinkable, it's so refreshing. Let's give it a rating. I'm a big fan of North Coast Brewing Company. Um, the, 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 the owner, he's either the owner or the brewer, he's got a big connection with the UK. Um, either his wife or something, something along the line that they, they, they were based in the UK once upon a time. And I think this is really good. It's part of the American Artisan series of beers, Brother Theolis, Belgium style Abbey Ale, 9.4% ABV. For me, it's a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Real Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Cheers.